So a lot of people have been wondering what's been going on with Pond5. There seems to be no sales up until today. So today I got a few messages and emails and even comments in the SML Mastermind private community about this data sets earning. I logged in immediately on my account and I saw that I had some sales. Now, what exactly is data sets earning? Now, companies are using music in order to train AI and train computers. What Pond5 is doing with Shutterstock is pretty much that they're working in conjunction with OpenAI and different technology companies that they're using AI in order to train computers, right? So in a nutshell, what they're using is our music in order to train these computers. That's it. Uh, it's no secret that AI is here to stay. There's no secret that libraries are already using AI to categorize and organize your music. That's why it's so important to have good metadata, okay? It's so important to have good metadata because if you don't have good metadata, keywords, tags, and, and whatnot, then your music is not going to be categorized appropriately, okay? So companies are already using AI to organize and classify your music in order to show these music tracks to the clients. So this is already happening, whether you like it or not. However, there are so much advancement when it comes down to AI and technology that computers need to learn. And the way that they are learning is by observing certain content and data like videos and photos and music that companies like Pond5 and Shutterstock have. So what they do is that they do a deal with these technology companies, AI companies, in order to feed this information, this data, if you will, to the computer so they can learn, so they can train them. Right? Wherever industry you go, AI seems to be like the big topic. Either you're a coder, you're a graphic designer, you're in sales copies, you wanna, you know, I mean, just wherever you go, everybody seems to be freaking out. There's another conversation about that this is a natural evolution and it's technology that is being uh, created as we speak and it needs the input of a human in order to become better and how we can use it to our advantage. Again, if you're new to Pond5 or if you're new to these libraries, you can go and check out everything that you need to know, the link in the description of these videos or any of my videos. This channel is strictly about stock libraries and nothing else will stop and it will always be about stock libraries. I will carry on talking about Pond5, Audio Jungle and all the other libraries that have uh, been in the market for so long and they're big, big players like Shutterstock, Pond5 and the, the rest. And companies are using already AI as we speak. And, and the funny thing is that composers are making money with this AI's technologies and they don't even know what it is. And that's the reason why I'm doing this video to let you know exactly what's happening and why are you earning this money when companies like Pond5 and Shutterstock are using your music to train AI computers. It's just the beginning. This is nothing that is gonna stop right now. And I'm really excited about the future. I'm really, really excited to see where technology is gonna take us when it comes down, not only to music, but to with videos, with graphic design, with photo. I mean, the potential for creativity is just endless. So I'm really excited about the future in AI and everything that has to do with technology. I hope you're doing well, my friend. If you're new to stock music and you would like to learn more on how you can earn money with your music, even with this latest technology of data sets earnings that you can have on Pond5, click the link below in the descriptions. So you can get started today. I'll see you in another video, my friend.